Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Master Duel is here. So, yups, uh, my time for today was quite limited, but um, I was able to, you know, play like a little under an hour and first impressions, it's fantastic. <laughs> it's, it's amazing. Um, obviously, I believe there were like three storylines that were open from the beginning and obviously I have to pick Monarchs, right? You, you, you just have to. Um, my favorite archetype and um, I managed to get some gameplay in like a small hour um, you know got some gems bought some packs already uh, like twice um, you know the, the pack of 10 to get you know the guaranteed super I guess and uh, let me you know tell this the, the crafting system is fantastic you um, at least at first I was like hmm uh, saw the prices of the gems and and I was like mm, doesn't really seem too promising but uh, now after you know getting some play testing the um, got myself to you know buying some packs all with like the gems from the storyline it's like ah it's it's quite good quite good uh, I need to play the storylines uh, a lot more you know to get those uh, gems right um, but uh, yeah first impressions fantastic amazing a small thing well small it's quite big it's uh, I believe if you are following the uh, the OCG rules, I mean the OCG format. So Maxi is legal. Eventis Emkins already have seen. Um, <laughs> that's bonkers. Uh, True King of all calamities. I've seen like pictures from other people as well. Um, so uh, you know my guess is that uh, we are getting our new DCG list really soon, and uh, that might be incorporated here in uh, in Master Duel as well. But it's um, I mean, I think we just have to wait for that. Make sure that, you know, you're not spending too much already. Uh, and then again, you know, you have your crafting system to trade in your uh, less useful cards, right? To get, at least I was trying to build monarchs. <laughs> you, you, you know, you have to get yourself a goal. And this is my first goal of the of the game, right? Get the full monarch deck. There is a lot of ultra rare cards like Aether, uh, Erebus, uh, Domain as well. Like in real life, monarchs is quite of um, a decent competitive deck. It's uh, super cheap as well in, in uh, real life here. Again, as I've mentioned before, we have a couple of ultra rares, so I need to, you know, pull those in, in order to trade for them, if that makes sense. Um, but, I mean, I've, I've seen people spend, like, uh, nothing, like, like, no money at all, and they already have, like, complete course of Eldritch or whatever. So, it doesn't really seem too bad. I need to, you know, get myself into playtesting more of the, the solo mode, right, to get those free gems. Um, as for the rest, yeah, the, the thing that that's, uh, I still need to check out is, um, uh, you know, competitive duels. I saw that uh, it's it's currently only in single mode, uh, which kind of helps this deck <laughs> because of domain, right? Um, but I still need to, you know, check that one out. But but for now, I just, you know, got like a, an hour playtesting in. Uh, first impressions, it's fantastic. I feel like that I'm like like a small child in a, in a, in a like a candy, uh, you know, factory. <laughs> it's, it's so um, amazing. It's amazing. So again, uh, feel free to, you know, leave suggestions. What should I do? What can I do? Solo modes. I'm not sure. I mean, you know, play through all of the solo modes and those feel like maybe a bit too long uh, of, uh, you know, a video, but uh, I mean, there's so much to explore. So again, feel free to let me know. Okay, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a comment or a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave me signing out. Peace.